As an unknown sophomore in 1984, Willie Smith took advantage of his anonymity to catch a school record 66 passes. The result, he was a second team All-American. This year, Smith predictably has found the going much tougher. Through seven games, he's caught just 22 passes and last week his first touchdown. Not seeing as much of the football has been an adjustment. I knew what to expect, you know, the coaches have been telling me and stuff, and uh, I figured, you know, pretty much that they would do that. But uh, what I did was I came back this summer and I worked as hard as I've ever worked. Willie really understood that you don't have to catch 66 passes to have a, a great football season because you're doing so many other things that they can't focus this on you because the other guys will be open, you know, because our offense, what we try to do is hit the open man. Although Willie's statistical contributions are not as significant as they were a year ago, he's making his presence felt in other areas, and he's had to change his game a little. Mentally and physically, because I was getting hit a lot more, and mentally I wasn't catching the ball, so I wasn't sure you know, how much I was uh, doing my job. But I was getting good blocking grades and stuff, and all my blocking was improving. We were winning, and uh, you know everybody was making the plays that was supposed to be making the plays and kept my confidence up. As far as the Hurricanes are concerned, there is one happy byproduct of all the attention defenses are paying to Willie Smith. As a result, wide receivers Michael Irvin and Brian Blades have found themselves open, open enough to catch 48 passes and 10 touchdowns so far. So rest assured that Willie Smith is as much a part of this offense as he ever was. In Coral Gables, Frank Fort, Channel 10 Eyewitness News.